Hey guys, so today I'm doing this smoky blue eye blue lips makeup look and I wanted to use some of the new stuff that I got recently. So the first main thing that I'm using, mainly eyeshadows, is the Kat Von D um, star studded eyeshadow palette thing that um, my wonderful YouTube sister Alicia gave me. So I really wanted to play around with this. And also the NYX uh, Wicked Lippies in Sinful. It's the really pretty dark blue that I'm quite obsessed with. And I wanted to create kind of a fun, smoky look for you guys. Um, so yeah, this will be the last somewhat normal-ish tutorial that I'm going to be doing for a little bit. I'm going to start my Exploration Beauty series on the 16th after I come back from Vegas um, and I'm going to be doing a lot of different Japanese inspired looks. Um, if you guys have any requests please leave them below and I will definitely do them. I want to do a bunch of different kind of Japanese fashion inspired looks. I already have like six planned out so yeah um, I'm really excited to start on that and for you guys to see it. So this is the most toned down one that you guys will get for a little bit, <laughs> especially for this month. Um, I might throw in some like Thanksgiving looks and Christmas looks obviously. Um, but I just really wanted to create something a little bit fun, a little bit dramatic, but also very easy and achievable to wear. And of course you don't have to wear the blue lips, you can pair it with anything you want like a nude lip, a darker, like, mauve lip, um, whatever your heart's desires. So, I hope you guys will enjoy, and, uh, go check out my vlog channel, because I'll have Vegas vlogs very, very soon. Um, thank you guys so much for watching, and on with the tutorial. Okay, starting off with a primer, I'm going to use my Mary Kay Eyelid Primer, and I'm just going to apply it all over my lid. And blend it out. And whatever is like left, I just kind of run it under the lash line. So the palette I am using today is the Kat Von D Star Studded Eyeshadow Book. I got this in a recent swap from my YouTube sister Alicia. So thank you. I am very excited to play with this, and this is my first chance to play with it. I'm very excited. So the first color I'm going to be using is called Estrella and it is this really gorgeous dark blue. And I'm going to apply that on my lid keeping it mainly um, on the lower part of the lid. Now I'm going to take a mixture of Heaven Knows and Damn and I'm going to be adding that into my crease, blending everything out. a bit of Starfighter, which is a really bright blue. I'm going to add that on the very center of my lid just to give it a little bit of definition. Going back in with Estrella to kind of bring back the color on the inner and outer portions. Blend a little bit more. I'm not adding any more on my brush. Just going to very lightly blend. And for a brow highlight, I'm going to be taking Moz, which is um, a 
peachy, pinky kind of skin tone, nude color, and add it as a brow highlight. And now I'm going to add some wing liner on the top. I'm going to use my Aurora felt tip liner. To kind of smoke it out and bring it about right in the center of my iris and add a white liner on the inner tear duct area it'll help keep your eyes bright and open with all the dark shadows going on and I'm just using the one I have from Jane in pure white And set it with um, Anti Star from the Kat Von D palette. It's just a, it's more of a satin white than a like, really shimmery white, but it is gorgeous. And instead of using black on the rest of the waterline, I'm going to be using a dark navy blue. This is the Wet n Wild Mega Last Retractable Eyeliner in Navy, and I'm just going to apply that on the rest of my waterline. So, now that the eyes are done, I just want to keep the face really basic, really simple. So, I just used a BB cream, and I used the Claire's Illuminating Blemish Balm that I am in absolute love with. This is great for if you're not feeling like having cake face, um, and you, but you still want a little bit of coverage. And I'm going to add just a little bit of highlight on my cheekbones. This is the City Colors Glowing Complexion Illuminating Cream. This is like the pinky color. I think they have like a golden color. But I'm just going to apply it on the tops of my cheekbones. And I really like that it has the little spout. I really like this. Um, you can mix this into your foundation or BB cream, and you instantly have like amazing glowing cheekbones. And it dries pretty. It, it's not like a powder, but it doesn't like have a sticky feel to it. I really love it. Um, I might do some cream blush. Let's do cream blush. The Maybelline Dream Mousse Blush in Peach Satin. I'm just gonna add a tiny amount because the stuff is pigmented right on the apples of my teeth. Just for a little bit of color. And then, um, I'm not gonna contour because I just don't feel like contouring today. Um, but if you want to go with like a cream or satin mousse bronzer, you can use the like Maybelline mousse bronzer. This is in Sun Glow. I like to use this sometimes when I'm just doing BB cream and stuff. And I just kind of take my finger and just kind of mark it and then blend it out. So for lips, I've been really wanting to create a look that I can wear my new NYX lipstick. This is the Wicked Lippy in Sinful and it is the really fun dark blue. If you follow me on Instagram you will have seen the swatch and um, I love this stuff so.
See how pigmented that is? It's ridiculous. I honestly wish I could wear blue lips like on a daily basis outside of like October because I would definitely do that. <laughs> and that is the finished look. So thank you guys so much for watching. Um, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up and um, check out all my social media below. By the time this video comes out, I will be in Vegas. So definitely go and subscribe to my vlog channel so you can check out all the Vegas vlogs. And yeah, I hope you guys have a great day and I'll talk to you all later. Bye! Century, 21st century love, can't you stop, let's go, you're too young to be running in a circle.